Good morning. Ik ben Natasha and welcome by the vlog. And in in mooie stad Utrecht. I hope you enjoyed my first attempt to do a Dutch intro, but for now I'm going to be switching back to English. And yeah, today we're going to be exploring Utrecht, one of my favorite cities here in the Netherlands. I'm not going to be doing it alone because I'm going to be joined by a good friend. Hello. Who are you? Diana. I uh, I am um, I am from Amsterdam and I moved uh, there a year ago from Israel. We are exploring the city and uh, we want to see what Utrecht has to offer us. Yeah. We're going to try to find Diana a bike. <laughs> yeah. You can already see how different the architecture here is. Some people come here for like the shopping and everything. But I think Utrecht city is much more than that. First things first, we're going to get Diana her bike <laughs> so we can bike around. But first we have to figure out how to get this OV feet. Too high? For us normal people, it is very difficult to bike this, yes. to ride this bike. Because first of all, it's a pedal, it's a pedal bike. Very, very for tall people. It's made yeah. the Dutch are very tall, so <laughs> not for us, not, not for, for us. <laughs> Good thing I brought my own bike. <laughs> all right, so to be honest, we don't really have a plan while we're here in Utrecht. So Diana had this crazy idea. <laughs> of um, coming up to strangers, asking them if they are local here and also asking their suggestions or recommendations about their favorite restaurants, hotspots and then we're going to follow their recommendations. We got a recommendation. We got a recommendation yeah. for a number of places called, one of them called Tiger Mama, the other Saigon Club. Street Food Club <laughs> And and uh, Vorstrad. So yeah, we weren't really successful in filming other people, but we have been asking some locals, and we did get some really good recommendations. One couple said that we should go to Audigracht. He was like, "Oh, it will blow your mind." <laughs> I'm <just> kidding. <laughs> no, but he said like, uh, "It's a really nice place, and, and we should definitely go there." So I think, uh, yeah, we're heading there now. We are in Audigracht, literally old canals, and it's supposed to be a very touristy part of Utrecht, but still, for me, one of the most beautiful canals. You can see that there are two floors here. On the first floor, you can see like a terrace for restaurants and bars, and it's just a great place to chill, especially on good weather. This place is so busy, so yeah. maybe we should go there and check Where? it out. PK? Yeah. PK bar. So lucky with the weather today, seriously. And this is the reason why we are enjoying a nice cold drink, because, yeah, why not? We're just quickly walking through the old city center on our way to find the Dom Tower since Diana wanted to do some sightseeing. <laughs> nice, there's a lot of cozy bars, cafes. Going to the Dom Kirk. Here we have the Museum Spielcock, which is a museum for, for basically instruments that play themselves. Oh, cool. So that's really cool. Yeah. It's like a medieval cathedral. And Inside looks pretty amazing. <laughs> and everybody who we talk to is agreed to talk to us, so it's nice. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you don't fall this time. <laughs> Three minutes. We're going to the street food club. They say that's a great restaurant. We're yeah. gonna try it out. 
This is like Instagram heaven. So beautiful, everything is filled with flowers. Her cocktail looks so amazing. Kissed by a rose. See the, like, it smells really, really good. It smells like a rose. Yes. <laughs> My cocktail is called Twice the Spice. It's supposed to be very refreshing, so it's like rum and ginger. Mm. Like so, so Diana and I have been here before, way before. Um, so, but now that you've been here second time or so, what do you think of the city? My favorite part about Utrecht is really just strolling around and just seeing the energy and the vibe. Everything was so busy today and it was great but in a different way than Amsterdam. It's more chilled out when Amsterdam is more busy. I really loved going to the Oudegracht, um, just walking, walking around there, having a drink. And also I saw Diana um, talk to locals, which is pretty funny and um, really nice as well. We found out how friendly the lo locals are. I guess in Amsterdam too, but I, I feel that the locals here are much friendlier. <laughs> Can't really feature them in the vlog, um, but, but they're okay. in our hearts. <laughs> <laughs> they, they were a big part of this making of the vlog. So, so we thank them if they're watching. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. So we're gonna take the bike back to Utrecht Central. Yeah. We're, we're gonna, gonna go home. <laughs> Bye. Bye. No, I'm back to Amsterdam. Back to Amsterdam. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to the Traveling Foxes so that you can get updated on our upcoming travel adventures around Europe and of course around the Netherlands. Doei! Diana just talked to some strangers. <laughs> Hey. Good job, girl. <laughs> I Very think nice. Diana already approached maybe like five strangers today. So that was good.